Hi, I'm Megan Hall, and welcome back to the Gen AI Toolbox, where I test and rate one generative AI tool every week so you don't have to. This week, I tested Visology, which is an innovation management AI tool. It has capabilities for brainstorming, product naming, market analysis, competitive intelligence, and more. I tested a seven-day free trial, but there are different plans that you can purchase if you're interested in using the tool. When billed annually, one costs $9 a month, another costs $19 a month, and the highest level plan costs $39 a month. The only difference is how many credits you get. I've tested Visology with a group before, but today I decided to test it using two things that are interesting to me, music and fashion. So I use Visology's brainstorming tool to help me figure out what a new product I could make in those spaces is. And I just put in simple keywords like music, fashion, combine, and app. And this is what it gave me. Once you get your results from Visology, you can save it to what's called a project, which captures all of the interesting and useful insights and ideas that you could get from Visology across its numerous tools. I use the corporate intelligence feature to figure out whether apps like what Visology suggested creating already exist. And this is where I ran into a little bit of trouble in that it wasn't totally accurate, but nonetheless, I do think it's interesting and it did do better with some less specific questions when I tested it with a group. I also use Visology's product naming tool to help me name my new app. And although a lot of the ideas weren't that great, I ended up settling on StyleSync. Here you can see the project that I was talking about earlier. So this is where I saved all the info I needed or found useful from my test with Visology. It would also allow me to fill in a swap form and it has other useful tools that you could use to put together a pitch, a presentation, an idea for new product development or otherwise. As a reminder, I'll be rating each tool out of five stars based on the following criteria. Ease of learning, time saved, quality of the end product, overall value, and practicality. I'll give Visology four out of five stars. I actually think this is a pretty great tool and my only major gripe with it is that it does tend to hallucinate, but at this point that seems to be every chatbot's problem, so I can't hold it against Visology too, too much. Its functionality otherwise is really great and I think it's fascinating that you can take such a small amount of nondescript keywords and turn it into a full-fledged idea for a new product. I would definitely be using this tool if I worked in innovation or in new product development, even as a jumping off point. When I tested the tool a couple of weeks ago with the group that I mentioned earlier, the consensus was pretty similar. People were impressed with its functionality and thought that it was great that it organized things into a project so that you weren't having to keep track of it all yourself. Thanks so much for joining me for episode seven of the Gen AI Toolbox, and I'll see you next Friday.